Okay. I'm not going to start with dragon slaying. What's up, Cynic? Because I have a strange, strange feeling that since I haven't played since Thursday evening, if I start with Dragon Slaying, I am going to die. Therefore, I will not do that. I'm going to do the beginning of the Civil War quest, Fort Tragstad, so I can do Corvan June and get the slow time shout. But I'm carrying way too many things right now. All right, let's assess my potion situation. Magic, frost, shock. I don't have any fire. I have these fire, I guess. Let me use up these first, I guess. Um, I got, oh my god, I have so many things. I don't have a grand soul gem. I do have a grand soul gem. Let's make my chemist effigy. Okay, sweet. Do I have the ring of pure mixtures? I don't think so. Yes, sir. What's up, acidic? Um. I just sell those staves. Whatever, I'll do that later. Get on with it. Uh, let's just go to Dawnstar first. Get the Ring of Pure Mixtures quest. Do the easy, low-hanging fruit. Need a Where do you want to go? Don't stop, please, Mr. Bjorlum. How you doing, Acidic? How's your um? Sun weapon shout build going. I have a feeling that's going to be super strong. Because if you ever get in danger, you're going to have so many procs off with your um, sunlight weapons. That you're just going to have to quickly go to be become ethereal. And you'll just instantly heal up because of the all the health regeneration. And the promised land with 70 restoration. Yeah, that always feels nice taking that perk. Oh, hello, friends. Um, vegetable, salmon steak. Nord mead. We'll take a resist magic. This. Get out this. Not hot enough. Does your Skyrim ever get warm, husband? No, not really. <laughs> This. You there. You're the one. When Lord Mirak appears, oh. Ooh, it's surpassing. Hell yeah. This gear is actually pretty dope. Magic. Magic 150. Magic region and 30 shock resist. That's not bad at all. Two surpassings. Oh my god. That encounter was definitely worth it. The mortar and pestle makes potion. No. I found well, aren't you sweet? Shrouded Grove. That should be an easy pickup here. Oh, we are actually already discovered Shrouded Grove too. Uh oh. Uh-oh. What happened? Wow, already with... Oh, oh, nice. Skyrim was just memeing on me. 
giving me a chug. Ready, Grail, let's go. Constitution potion. Uh, let's turn on our enchantments. Fire breath is ready again, and let's go. Solitude. Really haven't discovered Catless Farm, huh? Corbin June should be easy. Although there is a part where there are a lot of um, I mean, poor Fragstad should be easy. A lot of bandits all enclosed with you, but not too worried. You picked a bad time to get lost, friend. Where's Gathric? <laughs> dead what happened to my Gathrix war x Of healing potions. It makes more healing potions, I guess. Once the Gathic or once the Solicaneer. Those seems like very reasonable opponents to lose runs to. I've also lost shout runs both to Gathric and to Solicaneer before, so. And I very nearly lost the last, my attempt one at this build to Gathric last time. Wait, but what happened to my Gathric's War Axe? I just had it, and why do I have two of these? And now it's back. Okay. There's something funny going. things too early to get the build online yeah that's the major I I detriment of the shout build is it's just very <laughs> tempting to try and get things going as quickly as possible it's often worth it just to, to spend in a couple extra levels on bandit content 
using axes before trying to dive into the dragons and other more difficult frogger content. I think I want to get smithing to 50 here as a priority as well. Before I get like uh, my conjuration and alteration to 50. I'm close with conjuration, so I'll finish that up. And then I'm getting one handed up, I believe. Yep. Seventy dexterity perks is just so nice. Yeah, respite is just feels super nice. Just like infinite stamina, infinite magicka. As long as you're hitting things, it's always a uh, really nice point with something like weapons. Are you working on your seventy dexterity now? Yeah, I think at the end with my um, sunlight build, again, I was doing dual wield swords. If, speak Don't with you know put any stock in your own traditions? Bills. Are you prepared to make a plot? And uh, may the law. Now, if I'm not mistaken, Legate Ricca. If that's Don't you all, put any welcome to the Legion Auxiliary. Listen up. The chose the king. We're backing Elisid. When the moot meet. Not everyone's agreed to the moot. Mind yourself. No, it's not a simple. The rest of my men are already asleep. All right, we're only doing this for um, the slow time shout that's here. We're not gonna actually complete the Civil War quest. That's just foolishness. It's crazy how Legaricka can just absolutely solo this dungeon, anyways. We're already camped out around Looks like the, the damned rebels got. They don't follow me. She just destroys everything. Imperial Legion. What's up, James? You must be the new recruit. Welcome to the Legion. It's big data. Be careful. Yeah, if the Dragonborn never appeared, I think Skyrim would be just fine. As long as Lega Rika is around. Everybody. Dude. Even with the lower movement speed, Dexter, I mean, dual wielding is just so nice. We don't want any Stormcloak reinforcements taking us by surprise. Like, the area in front of you is just, like, instant stagger, do tons of damage.
Come on up here, you stormcloak dogs. Some kinds peace. Warm through days, 20 degrees today, drop 14 degrees. Twenty degrees is still kinda chilly, no? It's like how many degrees is that in Fahrenheit? Twenty C and F. Oh, 68. No, that's not bad at all. Conjuration, then I'll do smithing next. Our dragon fighting. I'm getting out of here. Rallis is running out of house and home. I need to start doing the uh, Agital quest line. I was gonna do it earlier, but I just got Gathrix instead. It's not as important to get the Agital boots. Probably, it's definitely more important for your build to get some some of that magic early. And this must be What's the of stories. We're not going to be spe uh, specking into magic perks until a bit later, and only for tankiness. All right, now we'll do smithing. Probably shouldn't have grabbed those smithing books so early, but whatever. This is this is meant to be a pretty late game build. All right, legionnaires, spread out and see what we've got. Auxiliary, do what you do best. See if we can find some way to get that table. We won't go enchanting, but we'll go alchemy, smithing as well. For um, crafting schools. Agitals is just going to be so good. We're not going to need anything else. be wearing my dwindling magic necklace. Or I keep Talos on actually. Let's see where this leads. Talos, Talos, Talos. I can just pop my shield on. You may be able to get away with just doing the infusion part of enchanting acidic if you feel so inclined. Oh, that's a tanky guy. Take that crown back. 
to Solitude Soldier. Hmm, interesting. We'll stay here and see if we can find anything else that could be of use. Did Aldo win today? Hopefully he... I'm sure he like three or four shot at him, right? With Ballundrung. 40 degrees, 140 Fahrenheit. Yeesh, 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 yeesh. Because smithing is just going to be like a very few perk investment. Because we're just going to need it. The first, we're just going to need like three perks for smithing. So it's going to give us a lot of armor and damage for just three perks. So it's definitely worth going. Not that easily, but he did it no problem. He's got dragon bone weapons, so you know how that goes. Yeesh. All the armor pin that is needed. All right. Do we do slow time? I think so. We'll put that on C. Or. 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 Boom. The Elemental Fury X. C is slow time. Perfect efficient spitting is yeah i mean especially if you're going for like pre pre-existing gear and the pre-existing gear is doesn't require uh like one of the specialty perks you know like ash at all's gear or gathrick's gear it's very efficient you don't even need any of the books Strewn Cavern should have some words that we need. There should be a recall spell in here as well, I thought. Percent versus sixteen. Definitely an improvement. What's the do we have a trait for this? I don't I don't think the shields get armor traits. Die Haven recall power.
Okay, cool. The only problem with this mod is that it clears all of your buffs. I used to dream. In the dream I was standing. Dragon Tooth Crater. That's where we need to go next. Nervous about these vampires, actually. a vampire when we want. If we want. What kind of dragon are you? That is a frost dragon if I've ever seen one. Or a fire dragon, I What are you doing over there, dude? It was a very short, slow time. I have a feeling with a fortify health potion we won't get one shot, especially if we have a um, shield out.
Oh yeah, I have shots. Let's use those. Oh, dirty. Oh, it's because it's part starting to decay. Definitely handy to have a shout, I mean a shield hotkey. So you can do your combo and then immediately switch to your shield. You get your movement speed back and you can block like I did a couple of times there. Which even on perk just does a shit ton of uh, damage reduction. Totally worth it. the last so we can go vampire if we want i don't think we want to yet because we don't have a good way to heal ourselves because we i mean we have 50 conjuration but we don't have any um uh there is a werewolf i can hear it Right off, bro. We're just gonna wait for my shout. I'm not, I don't want to get ragged all by this guy. Here, I'm gonna go ahead and preemptively put on my feather falling ring. Okay, ambushed by werewolves, ambushed by vampires. This is why you don't travel at night. You can only do it once a day? That's pretty lame. See you later, James. Thanks for hanging out. Ooh, oh, so close. Oh, so close to that destruction. Have I done Elder's Blood? Yes, I have. I ought to do Forsaken Cave. to do it. Why am I out of stamina? Forty percent, and that's with the necklace. Oh, that's with the necklace on. Okay. Oh, I need to get do that. That's just a free 5%, I think. Gear point. I don't want to do Croesus yet. Autumn Watch we've done. Mount Anthor we have not done, but it's very annoying. Ancient Descent we've done. Bone Shroon we've done. Northwind Summit, let's do it. Sometimes I have bad luck with 
North Wind. Wind Dragon. Y385. Oh, my hear scene ring. What's up here, scene? The course of a place here should we start to lose FPS. Oh, it's like after like an hour or so. I was like, oh, I could really start to feel the the um like a, like a real, like things are dragging. Skyrim is dragging its feet after like an hour or two hours. And it's worse when you do it to a lot of enemies. Like, especially in the Forgotten Veil, vale, I think I restarted like twice, I think. Doing Soul Care and Forgotten Veil vale stuff. Because it just drags so much. Stamina back. <laughs> Need to make some recuperation potions. I think what all I have left from my pre-mates are not that great. My damage is, I'm feeling it's pretty good. And I have a good rotation going with uh, switching between dual wielding and shield. Might be worth taking these dragon bones and putting them in the chests just in case. I don't think I'm gonna go for dragon bone armor, but I don't want to kill like every dragon in the game and then realize that I want to go for dragon bone armor and not have any more dragons to kill. Let's go for. No, definitely not unique to your setup. I was definitely having those FPS issues. This dragon battle is lore accurate. 
I guess I can, yeah, turn the quest in. Here is fine. Right. Excellent. This missive should convince him. Forty percent. Ah, and the parts that are, it means, I suppose, King Olaf. I find strange. No, that that is not. It has a few final lines, but that's all we need. Akaviri shield is actually pretty dope. 20% MR. Hey, watch it. I do hope the court likes the first. I think we've done an excellent job. I think my voice is ready. Hope we've done this well. Hopefully nobody knocks into you and interrupts your uh, retelling. I am. You mentioned something huh? that would convince us the festival should take place, but I didn't expect Olaf. King Olaf's last verse. No shouting match Please between proceed. dragon and... Olaf grabbed power by promise. And Olaf threat. sent word to Solitude's Jarl. So you have be careful. I thank you and the hey, college. Thank you, believe... Jarl. Oh, thank you yet again. I will make Unbel unbelievable. You've done us a great service here. I can't begin to thank you enough. All right. What a beautiful retelling of King Olaf's verse. I'm Pantia Atia, the master vocalist. Pardon me, but I trust you've been working on your poem. Yes, sir, I'm a pleasure to discuss. Just don't Bye. be late. Jorn. There he is. Uh, great. Looks like you'll be one of us soon. We'll gather outside the college for the first. and hard work of our With latest the lady. applicant. He becomes a full fled. What's the hurry? Welcome to Solitude, home of the arts. May songs feed you along. They like you. And finally, so nice to get this break from my place. Nice. For second cave. Yeah, let's do the winter or windhelm stuff that we need to do. Or lingering damage. Let's make some fortify health as well. We also have to do shriek wind at some point. Uh, 
for the uh, our final elemental fury word. Shock. Keep it in case. I can need this. We'll keep the fire and shock. Maybe I should be using Dragon Bane and Axe of White Run. What's up, pickles? I don't think we need these anymore. Since we have our shouts on a relatively short cooldown now. Kind of shit. Lots of bestial suit. Damn. Go ahead and make this. Not necessarily going to use it for now, but... Maybe we just do go ahead and do Shriek Wind now. After that convincing beat down. Oh, I really don't have that many of the, um, the vampires that we just fought. I think it's going to be fine. Fire breath. Better smite. Especially now that we have the destructive urge perk. That was even a three word fire breath.
straight shot at him. Nice. Shouts, yes. Yes, indeed. Shouts and dual wield. It's a it's a double. A lot of damage. It's gonna be really nice when also we get the um the perk that elongates increases the duration of uh shouts like elemental fury um and those kinds of shouts. percent duration and then we'll be done with our shout perks hmm now we just need to be able to absorb stamina somehow Ooh, creepy Or at least have some sort of solution for stamina. Uh, let's do Forsaken Cave. with my useless assistant here. Do some burning oils for our friend. I don't appreciate loiterers. That's what you're here to do. Hopefully there should be an... Oh, wait, no, we need to talk to... Shit. We need to talk to Aventus Aradino as well, so we can start that quest. Get the final word of Marked for Death. I think we killed Grelot. Our only question being... Do we want to kill the Dark Brotherhood or side with the Dark Brotherhood? Sweet mother, sweet mother, send your child unto me, for the sins of the unworthy must be baptized in blood and fear. I did the black... 
Of course. So I ran away and came home and performed the Black Sacrament. Now you're... Oh. Another dragon to fight. Excellent. Got the old work around here. If worse comes to worse, we can uh, just kite back to the old work. You can take care of the dragon for us. I've been. Yeah, got this. to pull Gunther, get the last word of Frost Breath. <laughs> Eat the older work is quite terrifying. What's up, these out? Mm, remember when we took damage from these fire dragons?
this harm to my shield. Why can he kite back so effectively? That was just annoying me. I was talking too much shit before. Oh well. He dies anyways. Oh yeah. I wonder how much we should be prioritizing trying to get Yolba lock. I mean it'll unlock a lot of damage, especially against like um dragon priests. And dragons. I had a magic resist. I think for single target enemies, it's now fat. It'll it's now better to do um, elemental fury. Ow. to make sure to use Gathrix for uh what's his name? Cure all mills we can get the Grand Soul. Probably before they land, cast the Elemental Fury. Do like a couple rotations. Switch to Fire Breath and then... That will be that. Once I have Yolba Lock, at least.
That axe is in um, red water den. Part of the Dawn Guard quest line. Gotta kill an ebony um, vampire to get it. So definitely not very attainable at this juncture. But eventually. Yeah, it's a named one. Forget what his name is. Nice try, Kiral Mill. Need to make more resist magic potions. Oh, I had my stuff on, reducing my uh, damage. Yeah, I've heard good things about Fallout. And that was from people who never played the games or anything. Highly recommend. Okay, yeah, I'll give it a shot. You the High King? We have always been the High King. But yes, we have the Crown of Tongues. Help with our shout cooldown reduction, which is at 45%. Oh, that's because we're not wearing the amulet. 35%. I'm surprised my derived isn't that high. Magic. Dragon 12, Dragon Sword. Was it 15? I just kill them i mean it's free gold the gold is better than what i would get for all the shots before Ald alduin 
Maybe not all of them. I just have a, a few key shouts that I want. A kill you. Make. Now it's time to face the consequences of your actions. You don't leave this. Watch us die to Astrid, bro. That'd be crazy. There's no way that we die to Astrid here. So. Whoever this is, clearly we got off on the wrong. Come now, whatever the problem, we can Wait. talk about it like civilized folk. Oh, hmm? Thank you, thank you. you. I'll never well, speak about this to damn anyone. Time. I promise. Ah, you see? Keep that your wasn't so like hard now, was it? Ridiculous. Let's the two of us just forget we ever met. Hmm? Oh, you mean like a speech check? Like, hey, give that to me. Actually, let me keep this because I'm the Dragonborn. Please. That instant invisibility from Astrid might make that fight even a bit more challenging. We have a shit ton of burst damage, so and of course it's going to be easy for this build, but no. I'm fairly certain you wandered into the wrong building. Gods, you're serious. You better report this to Commander Mero right away. He's at the penalty. Oh, you're here now. You, my friend. You've slain.
Good bit of damage there. Excellent. Boom. Do we finish up a speech? Let's just finish up a speech. Dark Brotherhood, your ass is grass. Yeah, I need to try a elemental build, an elemental mage build again, where I go actually go for like wind spells and stuff. Enchanting to one hundred or dex to ninety. Um, I haven't found the the reduced match or uh, movement speed as bad. with power attacks because most of the time you're staggering enemies no surpassing for you big boy so I would say go for enchanting Uh, what am I going next? Probably alchemy, right? Heavy armor? Nah, let's go alchemy. Alchemy 80 next, I think. The stamina is a non-factor. Yeah, I'll just go enchanting for the extra damage. The fun, but I'm so hesitant to uninstall my homebrew requiemless. How hard is it to get La Lang going? Oh, it's not hard at all. And especially since uh, if you go to the Discord, Ghoul, um, Ghoul Smasher uploaded a very handy video that just outlines exactly what you need to do to uh, upgrade Lala Land to the most recent F tweaks. Yeah, if Cicero was there, it'd be a menace. Menacing place. By all I hold holy, can it be true? Yes. Have you actually done it? Yes. This is a great day, my friend. 
Yes. You have struck a blow against darkness that will not soon be forgotten. Here, as promised, a most generous reward. Let's do full Gunther, and then we'll probably call it there. Um, I don't know anything about Vortex. All I know is, uh, MO2 is widely seen as the better option. But like I said, take that with a grain of salt. I don't know much about Vortex. But I have been using Model Organizer 2 for a very long time now. Model Organizer and Model Organizer. A dragon somewhere? I'm going the wrong way. What's up, homies? I need to get, um, like I said before, some kind of, some kind's of peace. Ooh, a filled Grand Soldier, hell yeah. Another grand soldier. The cooldown reduction is starting to feel very good now. Very reasonable. Aquail Snake. Aquail Snake. Aquail Snake.
Black Soul Gym. That's pretty rare for a Draugr Dungeon. Hey, that full Gunther knowledge. No shot. I'm gonna go back and watch the beginning of this character. Peace and love, Drew. Peace and love. Alright, let's get it. The axes, man. The dual wield axes. They move so fast and do so much damage. Yeah, so I don't want my uninstalling. I'm just kind of scared of the new mod organizer. The most intimidating to use for sure, but Wobjack lists usually tell you everything you need to do. Yeah, and then once. Once you learn it, I mean, usually the things that are the scariest have the most features, and that's why they're so scary. So once you learn it, then it's quite powerful. There's lots of lots of good resources to learn. Okay, I'm going to do one more dragon, and then we're going to call it. Uh, we'll do... Sheer... We'll do sheer point... Maybe we try a dragon priest as well. We can try a dragon piece, especially since we have marked for death full a full um What's it? All the words. We'll do Gastric. Oh, nice. Why are there two different? try wild jack either but it's really easier in my experience of just mainly searching for patches i have stable record list of about 98 so i'm not too bad at it wild jack is so good dude it has let me forget everything i knew about how to mod which is not great and not everything but i'm so spoiled now i don't want to do anything myself anymore all right let's do 2.5 Fortify health. I think Krosis shoots out a bunch of fire spells too. We'll just go ahead and use good. Oh, 
fucking hell? Oh, he fucking disarmed my, um, Akabiri shield. Ah. Okay. Touche, dragon. Touche. I was like trying to abuse my um, shield thing, but it wasn't uh, switching. What am I doing, dude? I hit him or miss. Ooh, that damage after mark for death. Ooh, that's nice. Alright, so Marked for Death is more important than Elemental Fury for sure.
Excellent. Level up. Now we can get our War Axe perk. Hell yeah, boy. More armor pin, more damage. What we need now is more stamina regen. How long does this last? Nine seconds, like 15 seconds, I guess. So A little bit more, like 17 seconds. And then mark for death, 12 seconds. Wonder how long that lasts. We are on our way. 30%. I think we we just need Talos now. Uh, let me hold on, let me take a look. 3BF tweaks. Talos blessing scaling, I think ends at 30. Let me see. 25. Ends at 25, and you get 30%. Ten, fourteen, nineteen. So we just unlocked eight. We just locked eight or the ten, fourteen, nineteen. Nineteen percent with eight dragon. Wait, one, four, eight, thirteen. No, we unlocked the twenty-four percent dragon or shout cooldown since we have more than thirteen dragon souls, right? Fourteen dragon souls. Oh yeah, Moth. 3B at Tweaks is... Now that I've gone 3B at Tweaks, I don't see myself going back. So I need these two to finish out these two. And that'll... That'll pretty much be all the ones that I need besides Dragon Aspect. I'll want Dragon Aspect and probably become Ethereal as well. Um, Predator's Might is going to be easy. It's just Angar Wound and then the above the tomb of Yskrimor. Slow time. I am going I am planning on doing the mage's guild quest, so um I will have to do I'll have to do labyrinthian and then what's where's the other one? Other one is in Hag's End. So I could do Hag's End right now easily. Forsworn are not much of an issue. I just have to get um some sort of snack probably. Get a like grilled chicken breast, and then I have my constitution potions. I could probably make much better constitution potions by now. Let's see, actually. We could probably do Azhidal now, to be honest. But I don't really need Azhidal until um, I start messing around with uh, my mage skills, like Conjuration and stuff. alteration I might go alteration first constitution potion are now what 70% yeah
Yeah, we could do hags in pretty easily. Get some resist fire potions on deck. Forty-four percent. Yeah, hell yeah. Found weapons on this character. Yes, we are just kind of. I am prioritizing my. Oh my god, I can't believe I haven't gotten. I should have gotten Storm of Steel first instead of the War Axe one. Oh well. We're definitely getting Storm of Steel first. I am prioritizing the main skills first and getting all the perks that I need. And then I'm. Because the. My Conjuration and my Alteration are really just going to be like supplemental. Um, I'm going to do Bound Armor and uh, Bound Weapons, like a Bound War Axe, just for reliable Soul Trap and a weapon that I don't have to keep uh, recharged. Plus, the extra tankiness from Bound Armor is going to be really nice. But, so I finish with Speech. My, uh, my four Speech. I'm done with Dexterity for a while, because I have, um, Alchemy to get to 80, and I have Heavy Armor to get to 80 before I start messing with Dexterity anymore. Once I get Alchemy to 80 and Heavy Armor to 80, I'll probably take Dexterity up to 90. Um, and then one handed is, is done for a while. I'll, uh, all I need is the storm of steel perk. You imagine this also increased, uh, attack speed. That would be dope. I just need the storm of steel perk. Yeah. The bound armor is going to be really nice and an extra, um, extra damage reduction it's always good what's up that one heavy armor we're just gonna need up to the combat trance we're not going for any spells higher than adept uh until like maybe we'll get mage armor four i don't know but we're just going primarily mage armor three transmute muscles um maybe an absorbing cloak those are my three alteration spells that i'm going to focus on and then Conjuration is just Bound Armor, also an Adept spell, and Bound War Axe. So I'm pretty much almost done with my main skill perks. I do want to get some, the Craftsmanship and Advanced Blacksmithing perks pretty quickly. So I can upgrade my armor and my weapons. Gatherix is high grade, which is super nice, but like be to have a higher tier of the rest are going to be really important. And it's not that many perks to invest to get the extra damage. All right, Kaviri shield. I don't think we need these actually. It's away. I don't want this. I will keep the Stagmir's ring. No, I mean, we have the ring of here scene. Um, I need to look into maybe doing the, um, the Mira quest. Because we already have health 2 and stamina 2. So, the Ring of Here scene is just giving us 50 health and stamina. And then the Ring of Namira would give us, like, 50 health and 100 stamina. So maybe I'll mark that on my list to do for next time. Um, Ring of Namira quest. Ring of Namira quest. Corvin June, we did, we've done. Full Gunther, we've done. Cross those off. Um, so now it's just a dragon slaying. Ring of Namira quest, offhand, and then Sarth, and then the Mage's Guild quest is probably what we'll, or the College of Winterhold, sorry. It's what our next focuses are going to be. Um. We should get enough insights doing off and stuff uh, to get alchemy up to 80 and heavy armor almost there. Yeah, between off and black reach and then the mage's guild, we should get both heavy armor and alchemy up to 80 and we should get enough perks and then we can start doing well, the Augma Infinium, I think with the four perks that I get for 
the Agua Infinium. Where do you get three perks? I think you get three perks, and then you get a potion of extended path from uh, Power of Mazark. I'll probably do one, two, three, four. Just button up all of Alteration. Um, maybe one, two, three, four. No, I'll probably do one, two, three, four, because I probably won't be able to dual cast like Mage Armor three. Maybe not even transmute muscles. And then after I do that, then I'll probably get Ajidols. And then with um, with Marked for Death, I should be able to just eviscerate Ajidol. Just stack up a bunch of Fire Resist and Magic Resist, and then just go ham on him with uh, Marked for Death. Like we did with uh, Krosis. The Dagger, Poison, Blade, Fury. A little Mafala, Loverstone. Would not be bad, honestly. Like, maybe even for Ajidol. What would I be giving up? I'd be giving up, like, maybe 30. 30-ish Shout Recovery. Just cast Elemental Fury, and then... But I get the full Mafala Blessing, and I can reduce Poison Resist of Ajidol. I don't know. It may be worth looking into. But... Oh, we could also use Nettlebane. I just did it. You'll be way stronger. Yeah. Because once you get all, once you're wearing four pieces of Azhadal's gear, so we'll do probably the armor, boots, gauntlets, and then um, the, uh, one of the rings, probably the conjuration ring, and then we'll keep our uh, crown of tongues. We'll keep our headpiece. Then we get a bunch of magic resist, and we also get a bunch of ar just free armor rating, which is great. But actually, I don't know. Gathric's armor is pretty pretty dope as well. It's like the perfect mid game armor for this build. And even into if you're not going any magic, if you're just going pure warrior shout, it's very good in game as well. Just get some smithing to get it up to get it up to snuff. And it's, the enchantments are not bad. I mean, Stamina 2, Stamina Region, Carry Weight, Health 2, Health Region, and then Blocking, Armor Rating, and Magic Resist. I mean, the magnitudes on all these are not that high. Um, but th there are a lot of different enchants, and they're all very useful. So, hard to, hard to find anything to fault with that armor. But we're going to call it there. Like I said... I've gone a little longer than I usually do on a uh, on a work night, but I got back from my travels this weekend, and I wanted to do some streaming, so it is what it is. Um, appreciate everyone watching. We made some good progress today, and we will make more. All right. Have a good one, everyone. Peace.